Hey guys, I wanted to talk to you today about a time saving a program that I use to help me with all of my social media, especially Facebook. Okay, so there's lots of different programs out there uh, that you can use to schedule your posts. Um, but I'm going to talk about one specifically called Tiny Torch. Um, and I'm going to show you exactly how to, how to use it and how to make it most effective for you. When you're posting on Facebook, besides for the 555 rule that I talk about, you should also make sure that you're posting at least one time a day onto Facebook. And at least um, some of those posts, probably a good majority of those posts, should be family and inspirational and fun. And maybe one out of those seven should be selling, booking, or recruiting. So I like to schedule those types of posts at least once a day, especially when I'm on vacation or I know there's a lot going on with my kids or it's summertime, so that I don't have to worry and I know that I am interacting on Facebook because that's exactly what Facebook is all about. It's creating connections and interactions, and so I like to do that. Now, Tiny Torch will let you post onto your personal page, onto your business pages, and onto groups and events. So it's super easy. It'll post to everything that you manage on Facebook. Um, I like to use it for my hostess and party coaching um, because I always want to make sure that when I set up an event on Facebook uh, for my hostesses that I'm posting in that event regularly. So when I set up the event, I just go ahead and schedule all of my posts onto Tiny Torch. That way I never have to worry about posting onto that event. Um, also for flash sales, it makes it super easy to do any of your groups like your VIP group or your personal team group, um, a way to constantly be interactive with the people that you are being social with on Facebook. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to switch over my screen so that you guys can see the program and we're going to walk right through it. If you have any questions for me, make sure you put it in the comment section below. I'll be happy to answer it for you. Okay, ladies, so here's my screen so that you can see where we're at. Uh, the application is called Tiny Torch, and you can find it by going to app.tinytorch.com. Um, once you're in um, the program, you obviously have to log in, and I'm already logged in because I have an account. You're going to go ahead and you're going to go to your profile and set everything up. But you're going to go to social accounts, which is right here, and you want to set up your Facebook account in here. At least your Facebook account, if not your Facebook business pages and your Twitter account. You can have up to five linked social accounts. Your personal page is one of them, and every business page that you have on Facebook is another one. You just press add social account and Facebook or Twitter, whatever you want to do, and it'll take you there to sign in um, and so forth, so you don't ever have to worry about any of that. Okay, I'm already set up, so I'm going to take you back to the home page. When you get to the home page, you will see the point of Tiny Torch and any of these type of sharing programs is to be able to share content. So you can look up all sorts of content that other people have posted and everything that you actually put onto Tiny Torch is also made public. One of the best searches on this particular program is that you can actually type in Pure Romance and you can see everybody else's posts that have ever posted um, with Pure Romance um, in the words or in their names and things like that. You can find some pretty great um, posts to use as well as just inspirational and fun things to use. So lots and lots of ways that you can use Tiny Torch um, to find things to put onto your um, Facebook page, your own personal page. Now to create a post, all you have to do is just go to create and um, it's super easy. You can just select an image. Um, I personally have, um, like especially for parties, I have a whole folder of different things. So let's say I'm interested in um, a booking blitz uh, post and I know I'm not going to be home tonight uh, because I have my kids play, but I do want something to go on to Facebook during that time. I'm going to go ahead and post this. So I'm going to go ahead and open up that picture. I'm going to type in something fun to say about this photo that I want to actually post with the photo. I might tag it so that other people um, on Tiny Torch can find this particular post. You have about 5,000 characters that you can use with Tiny Torch, and then you press create. This post is now live on Tiny Torch, or actually, once we press it, there we go. This post is now live on Tiny Torch and super easy to use. Okay, you can go to my posts and you can see all the posts that you have created.
And collections is how you can actually organize these posts. So you can like take this post, which is what I post is my first post to a party, and you can actually add it to a collection and you can create a collection called party posts. And so you know when you are scheduling all your posts for one particular party, you can go ahead and go to your party post and it'll just let you see that. Okay. Now um, it also allows you to see all of your collections, which I don't actually have anymore because um, I stopped using Tiny Torch uh, for a different program that you have to pay for. But I don't recommend that you do that at first until you realize or find that you're scheduling a ton of posts and you just want an easier interface. Um, and schedule posts just lets you see everything that you have scheduled or any posts uh, that you have actually posted before, any errors that don't actually post. So let's go back to figuring out how to actually post something on Facebook. So let's say I'm, you know, doing my booking blitz and I want to go ahead and actually post this tonight. I'll click on that particular post. I'll scroll down and I am going to share this post. It's going to ask me where I want it shared. So I'm going to share it with myself um, on my personal page and it's going to ask me where on the page I want it. Do I want it on my own personal page? Do I want it as part of the events? And it allows you to select two different places in your personal profile that you can share. You can share it to an event. Um, once you scroll all the way down, those are all of my events. It's going to ask me if I want to post it to a group. Now the groups that you can post to are the groups that you are an administrator of. If you're not an admin for the group, you cannot post to it using Tiny Torch. You have to actually go in and make create that post yourself. So I've chosen that I wanted to post to my event. I go in, I check to make sure that um, my message is totally fine, and then I say, do I want to post it now or do I want to post it later? Um, so I'm going to go ahead and say, I want to schedule this. It's going to ask me when to share it. And let's say I want it to go tonight at 6 o'clock. Um, so 6 p.m. tonight, um, that's when I want it to go. And I'll click Done. And so this is actually going to post on my event because that's where I chose it to go. So my event, I didn't want it to go on my personal profile, but you can post it wherever you want to go. Um, and you can click Schedule. Now that's done, boom, and you're taken to your schedule posts, and you can see everything that you have scheduled. If, for example, you have a party that cancels or changes dates and you need to change when you want things scheduled, you can just go scroll through by date and you can click and easily see where things are scheduled to, and then you can edit them, simple, oh, awesome. <laughs> this feature is temporarily disabled while they resolve a bug, but normally you can just go ahead and edit that um, to do. Once that's actually po uh, posted, you can find that in your scheduled posts posted section. So Tiny Torch is really great, easy, and convenient to use. Um, a fabulous uh, program, and I highly, highly suggest, at least for hostess coaching, as well as any type of flash sales, that you use this program. Any questions you have, make sure you post them below, and have fun Facebooking.